Hey, what is up guys? Dusty here. And I know a lot of you are probably thinking, what the hell? Where did this guy come from? I figured he was never going to make any videos again. And you were almost right, but I am actually back. And this video, oh, well, right here, there's going to be a huge drop shot fail. It's kind of funny. I don't know what the hell I was doing. I don't know how I survived it. Anyway, the reason that I haven't had any videos for you in like over a month again is because I have not been playing Modern Warfare 3 at all. Any of you that might be friends with me on Xbox have probably realized this. Anytime I'm online, I'm playing like NHL or Black Ops or something. That's just because this game kind of frustrates me. Um, I pull host a lot because I have a pretty good internet connection. And if any of you guys know how bad it is when you get host in this game, you know what I'm talking about. I kind of rage a lot. With Black Ops, it's the other way around. Whenever you pull host in that game, you just pretty much destroy people. And that's why I like that, because I'm better at it right now. <laughs> So I've been playing a lot of Black Ops, but at the same time, I am not sure, or I wasn't sure if any people would actually be interested in Black Ops videos. I figured everyone would just kind of be like, eh, who cares about this? It's all about Modern Warfare 3 right now. So that's kind of why I haven't been putting up any Black Ops videos. Maybe I will once in a while if you guys really want to see some. I have a couple of high-kill gameplays I could post, but I don't really want to do it right now. I'd rather just post some more Modern Warfare 3 for you. So that's why I'm uploading this video. It's a Sea Town domination on Ground War from a couple months ago. I, you know, go off. I have a really good life at one point, and it was overall a pretty exciting game. But anyway, yeah, I'm not really sure what I want to do. I'm gonna try to get back into Modern Warfare 3 to try to get you guys some good gameplays, cause it is kind of a fun game when it's fun, but when it goes bad, it can be really frustrating. I'll see what I can do for you there. I'll probably get some more good gameplays up. But, I don't know what else I want to post. I do want to expand and post a couple of different games. Maybe I'll do some Black Ops gameplays. Maybe I'll do like a Let's Play or just a playthrough of some new games. I was thinking about getting Max Payne 3 or something. It kind of got mixed reviews, but we'll see. I never really let that stop me. I've loved the Max Payne series ever since the first game came out. So, I don't know. Maybe I'll do something like that. Maybe not. But, I think... I think that's it in terms of updating, updating you about my situation. So, uh, what is new, guys? I have not played this game in a while. I just logged on today and played a couple games, and obviously I had to download an update, I figured. So, what is new? Um, you know, let me know in the comments, because I'm too lazy to check it out myself. Did anything about the game change? Did it get better or worse? Or, you know what? But anyway, I'm going to probably start playing later and see if I can actually get some more Modern Warfare 3 gameplays for you. And this right now, this life you're watching, I believe is my um, awesome life. Right here, there's kind of a funny situation that happens. Yeah, so I go up here, go up the ladder, shoot down these guys. They're obviously spawning in this little dome building. I kind of ran away like a little bitch to, because I was hurt. But I know I go back in a second, and I start chasing these guys around, and I completely lose track of everyone. And you know, I guess it didn't happen. Oh, yeah, it's coming up right here. But yeah, I was trying to mainly stick to the sides of the map for certain periods of time, but I was also trying to be conscious of the B flag because the enemy team was really pushing hard for it, and I wanted to get the victory first and foremost. I'm always going for an MOAB, always going for a YouTube gameplay, but at the same time, if we end up losing the game, it's kind of pointless. I play to win first. So I was trying to run around the sides of the map and control areas of the map, but at the same time be conscious of the B flag, which they were pushing for hard. Yeah, right here is the funny area. That one guy disappeared, and I was like, where is he, where is he? I thought maybe he climbed up the ladder to chase after me, but no, I kind of just did a loop for no reason. He was behind me, and yeah, I probably looked like an idiot. Thankfully, no one was watching me there. But, yeah, so see, obviously right here they have the A flag, and that's the only flag they have, so I'm just trying to do laps around where I think they're going to be spawning. Kind of just doing laps around this house area, but at the same time trying not to stay out in the open for too long. I know they're going to be spawning in the house and in this circular building on this side, so I don't really want to stay out in the middle too long. And then every once in a while I'm returning to the B flag just to keep an eye on it, just to make sure that we're not losing it. I know we lose it a couple times when I get distracted with other stuff. My team wasn't really very good at watching the B flag. I think I capture it like three times or something during the game. So that's why that's one of the reasons why I uploaded this. I was really happy with my personal performance as well as how I helped the team out. Um, yeah, so right there, the spawns flip, and thankfully I didn't get caught in any kind of, you know, crazy spawn situation. No one spawned behind me or anything, and I was able to uh, get into their spawn once again, and unfortunately, I didn't see anyone, which is really rare for a Seatown Ground War. Usually, this is a real hot spot area, 
Finally, I was able to find some guys and cut it pretty close right here. But, I mean, actually, there was a couple times in this life where I came really close to dying. People chuck grenades at me and blast shield save me, or people got a couple bullets on me. So, yeah, this could have really went differently. I really don't think that I'm any better at Sea Town now than I was, or, you know, than I have been my whole career. I still suck at it. <laughs> Luckily, I just, you know, got really lucky this game and had a couple close calls, but for one life, no one was able to uh, get that kill shot on me. So right here, I run up. I know I'm pretty close to the MOEB, and that's really all I want. And I barely get it, and I die right after. <laughs> and of course, they take the B flag while I'm at it. So I'm trying to formulate a strategy to get this B flag back. And the enemies are obviously defending it really tough. The Sea Town B flag is not a good one to take. Usually, if you're throwing yourself on it, you are going to die a whole bunch. So right here, we get a good spawn, get the A flag back, and I decide to try to time my MOAB blowing up with me capturing the B flag. I figure that would be a pretty good idea. Unfortunately, I don't time it quite right. Um, you know, it doesn't blow up, and I'm just capturing the flag. Luckily, I didn't really need the bomb to go off to capture the flag, but I guess it doesn't hurt to have it go off right now. <laughs> So we end up getting that back, and I cut out part of the game here, and I just kind of fast forward to the end, because, you know, the rest is fine. I don't do bad or anything. I don't die a million times, but really, the only reason to watch the gameplay would be for the first half. The second half isn't nearly as exciting, so I fast forward to the end, just to show you that we did end up winning the game. I captured the, feet, the B flag two more times, so yeah, my team wasn't really doing a very good job at defending it, but hey, we got the victory. Well, it's good to be back, guys. I'm going to see what I can do with Modern Warfare 3 gameplays. Let me know in the comments any, anything you'd like to see. Uh, if you have any comments on anything I talked about, really just give me some feedback here. Anyways, thank you for watching. Uh, see you later.